सी आई ई टी एन सी ई आर टी प्रेजेंट्स टू यू दीरीज नेक्टर ऑफ पोएट्री फ्रेंड्स इन दिस सीरीज वी ब्रिंग टू यू द पोएम्स बाय सम वेल नोन पोएट्स ऑफ इंग्लिश इन दिस प्रोग्राम वी ब्रिंग टू यू द पोएम केस्ट बर्ड माया एंजलो बॉर्न 1928, डाइड 2014. Maya Angelou was born in St. Louis in the United States of America. She dropped out of high school and became the first female African American bus conductor. She was an actor, director, poet, singer and composer and became a university professor. She faced many hardships in life. One of her most famous poems is titled Caged Bird which we shall listen to now Caged Bird A free bird leaps on the back of the wind and floats downstream till the current ends and dips his wings in the orange sun rays and dares to claim the sky but a bird that stalks down his narrow cage can seldom see through his bars of rage his wings are clipped and his feet are tied so he opens his throat to sing the caged bird sings with a fearful trill of things unknown but longed for still and his tune is heard on the distant hill for the caged bird sings of freedom the free bird thinks of another breeze and the trade winds soft through the sighing trees and the fat worms waiting on a dawn bright lawn and he names the sky his own but a caged bird stands on the grave of dreams his shadow shouts on a nightmare scream his wings are clipped and his feet are tied so he opens his throat to sing the caged bird sings with a fearful trill of things unknown but longed for still and his tune is heard on the distant hill for the caged bird sings of freedom for the caged bird sings of freedom dear friends the first stanza beautifully describes the liberty of a bird that rides on the back of the wind up to the orange horizon In contrast the second stanza describes a bird ranging in a narrow cage the wings are clipped and his feet are tied the caged bird can only sing of freedom the contrast makes the reader feel the caged bird had earlier experienced liberty so His agony is more intense 
His grief is expressed through his song. Yet, even with its clipped wings, tight feet, narrow cage and bars of range, the bird is able to survive because of the desire for freedom. The mind can never be caged. Dear friends, during pre-independence times, the British kept a watchful eye on newspapers and periodicals and censored any poem or article on freedom. Yet, the idea of freedom was propagated by the power of the pen through poetry, song and drama. You may read a poem, Vidathalai, by the freedom fighter and poet Subramanya Bharti in translation. Friends, you were just listening to this program. Subject Coordination, Dr. Ravindra Kumar. Subject Expert, Dr. Vardha M. Nikalje. Support, Department of Education in Languages. Artist, Suchitra Gupta. Recorded by Bati Langlingdo. Production Assistants, Vimlesh Chaudhary. Directed and produced by Ajit Horo. This program is presented to you by CIET and CERT, New Delhi, India.